I am Irene Khan. I am Director General of the International Development Law Organization. IDLO started working in Afghanistan uh, in 2002. So we have done a lot of work in the justice sector, uh, including on women's access to justice. Uh, recently, uh, on March of this year, we started a new project where we are now uh, one of the largest providers, probably the largest provider, of training to justice sector officials, that's judges, lawyers, investigators, and prosecutors uh, across the country. We have eight offices in different provinces of Afghanistan, as well as mobile teams that are trying to build the capacity of these officials. The idea is that in two or three, three years' time, by 2016, we will hand over to the government uh, the capacity to train. So we are not only training Afghan officials, we're also training the trainers. This is a massive transfer of capacity and uh, expertise uh, to Afghans. Of course, we are also concerned, like everyone else, uh, about what will happen in, in the future in terms of the political certainty, political systems, because rule of law doesn't exist in a vacuum. Legal systems are very closely intertwined with uh, political systems, with the, the executive, with the legislature. So that remains, uh, of course, an issue. On the other hand, I would say at a very personal people level, I see enormous commitment. I have visited classes where uh, we are training uh, judges, lawyers, prosecutors, investigators together and I have found huge interest in these classes of ordinary judicial officials who want to learn, who want to be empowered, who want to make a change in their own country and I think it's that kind of uh, investment in people that is probably going to be sustainable uh, no matter what happens in the future.